Hey, what's up? Jigzer here. Discord's community guidelines make it clear that content unsuitable for users under 18 must be age-restricted. If you're having trouble viewing certain channels or servers on your iPhone, there are ways to access this age-restricted content. In this video, I will show you how to access age-restricted Discord from your iOS device. Let's go! Conveniently, Discord has a setting that lets you access age-restricted content on your iPhone. Before you start, note that this particular method only works on the desktop or web version of Discord. Also, if your Discord account shows that you are under 18, you will not be able to join these age-restricted servers right now. To learn more, skip to the next timestamp, otherwise follow along to the next steps. To begin, open your browser. Go to discord.com app and sign in. Navigate to the three-line menu in the upper left corner. Click the gear icon for user settings and head to privacy and security. Locate the server privacy default section and toggle on allow access to age restricted servers in iOS. While you're there, you might want to turn on allow access to age restricted commands from apps in direct messages too, so you won't miss any commands in your private chats. After activation, be sure to first connect to the Discord server of your choice from your computer or browser. Then, you'll be able to access it from your iPhone app. If you're under 18 and locked out of an age-restricted server, you can request an age update from Discord's Trust in Safety team. First, grab your photo ID and a piece of paper with your full Discord username on it. Snap a selfie holding both items clearly visible. This is one of the requirements that Discord requires in order to update your information. Next, head to support.discord.com slash hc slash en dash us slash requests slash new and choose appeals, age update, other questions. Use the email link to your Discord account. Select update my age information and enter your correct birth date. Attach your photos to the request, submit it, and keep an eye on your email for a response from Discord. Okay, if I've been able to assist you, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you enjoy taking photos and videos with your iPhone, please visit my website. Over the last few months, I've created a video course where I've gathered the best tips and tricks on how to make the most out of your iPhone for photography. You'll find the link to the website in the video description. Until next time, bye!